Um, in this video, I'm going to show you a really silly brain break activity, which is great when you're teaching younger children online and you need something to get up that energy and just hype them up again. So it's called Silly Faces and basically you want um, everyone to be on gallery view in Zoom or whatever, um, whatever you use and you want everyone to be really aware of their square that they appear in because everything is about their square. So I would give instructions and um, then I count down from five and when I reach zero, they needed to have done what I asked. So my first instruction might be, please disappear. I go five, four, three, two, one, and I expect them to in some way disappear. So, and then I'd want them to stay hidden um, for my next instruction, which might be to make your face as tiny as possible in your square. So they'd move back as far as they could to get the smallest face possible. Then I might ask them to disappear in a different way. So they could cover their camera or they could disappear in some other way. Uh, the next one could be to make your face fill your entire square. So they've got to get really close to fill the whole thing. Uh, another good one is to make the silliest face possible within that square and then you can do anything really you want to. For instance, you could be, you need to have one hand and one foot in your square. Or you need to um, make sure your head appears in the bottom corner of your square. So loads of different things that just get the kids moving around and give them a little bit more energy so that then they're um, ready for learning again. And once you've done this a few times, you could give the responsibility to um, a, a child in your class and get them to call out instructions for you and for the others to follow. Uh, this game really has never failed to hype up uh, the younger children I teach and um, you might actually need another extra little calming exercise afterwards to get them to focus again.